Good day, MES community! Good day, Team Grade 1! Ang ang teacher Mabel P. Abuel at sa pagdiriwang ng National Grade Month, syempre, mas masaya kung kasama namin kayo. Kids! Pero sa activity na gagawin ng Team Grade 1, hindi lang kayo ang kasama namin. Isama natin ang inyong mga parents. Isama natin si nanay, si tatay, si daddy, si mommy, si papa or si mama para mas masaya. Parents, alam ko po na karamihan sa atin ay pagod sa maghapang paggawa. Pero alam niyo po ba na Reading bedtime stories may be the perfect opportunity to offer some precious time and attention to your child. And did you know also that this simple reading activity brings more benefits than simply preparing them to sleep? That said, there's something very special about a bedtime story being read out aloud. A bedtime story does not require children to focus on the mechanics of learning to read but on the enjoyment of the story and the idea of being transported to other worlds before drifting into dreams about them. May mga ilang dahilan kung bakit magandang i-practice natin ang pagbabasa sa ating mga anak bago sila matulog. Una, it's a good bonding time. Study shows that 60% of us feel that reading to our children brings us closer together. Number two, it improves your child's reading skills. Just because you're the one doing the reading, don't assume that your child is not learning. You will be surprised, mga mommies, mga daddies, na ang inyong mga anak ay natututo ng pagbabasa following the words and starting to recognize them on the page. That sparks imagination. Reading bedtime story also creates conversation. Reading together can trigger all sorts of wonderful questions and stimulate conversation which can help to understand their own place in the world. It helps you relax and unwind too. Many of us introduce a bedtime story in the baby days as part of our little one's evening routine and it can still help promote relaxation at bedtime even for older children. So, hindi lang ngayon na bata sila kahit hanggang sa paglaki nila. Pwede pa rin. At the end of a busy day, a bedtime story can be a way of leaving the day behind, helping the whole family switch up so that whatever stress and noise has happened throughout the day can be forgotten. Tam paalis stress din at tam paalis pagod din yan mga mommy at mga daddies. Kids, lagyan natin ng konting twist ang ating activity para mas sumasaya. Why not? Isuot ninyo ang inyong paboritong pajama kapag binabasahan na kayo ng inyong mommy o ng inyong daddy. Di ba mas masaya yun? Magpapicture muna bago ipagpatuloy ang pagbabasa. At ang inyong best shot kasama ang inyong parent o kung sino malang kasama niyong nagbasa sa inyo bago matulog ay isend sa group chat ng inyong klase. Mas masaya din kung i-upload niyo din sa inyong mga Facebook account. Gawin nating masaya at makulay pa rin ang pagdiriwang kahit may pandemya. Tandaan, basa na sa MES ka, tuloy-tuloy pa rin ang pagkatuto. Learning never stops at MES. Happy reading!